Real McCoy 411. For the safety of your eyes, I will not reveal what is under this cap. I will not do it. No, 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 no. Let's just say, um, still under the weather. Yeah, still under the weather. Um, but I'm going to fix that problem today because I'm going in with Kara Kara. Kara Care. I'm going in with Kara Care sh Moisturizing Shampoo. Kara Care Moisturizing Kara Essence Conditioner and Kara Essence Shampoo. I make sure I try to say every word that's on here. I'm going in with Kara Essence Moisturizing Leave-In Conditioner. These are the things that I'm going to take to the shower with me, okay? When I come out of the shower with you guys, I'm going to apply the Care Care Buttercream um, with Shea Butter, Cocoa Butter. Oh, my eyes getting bad. That's it. Because I think the other words are in another language. Or oh, I'm just going blind. I could just be going blind. Buttercream. Okay. And then they also have a clear protein styling gel. This is what I'm going to seal it in with. Okay. And to make sure it's sealed in, I'm going to add a dab of my Blue Magic Castor Oil. Yeah, Candy's having to melt down because she saw my hair before I put this bunnet on. And I'm not going to do y'all like that. So I'll be right back. Hair will be washed. No, no, no. Hair will be shampooed, conditioned, leave-in condition will be added. Hair will be separated into sections and ready to be twisted. Let's get it. As I'm back, hair is shampooed, conditioned, deep conditioned, no, leave-in conditioned. I did not deep condition my hair. I skipped that step. Shoot. Okay, I have to get that on the next round. I did not deep condition my hair. But that's okay. Every once in a while, every once in a while, you miss a step. I miss a step. I did not deep condition my hair. Sue me. Allegedly. <laughs> Allegedly, I did not deep condition my hair. It's an entanglement. <laughs> uh, anyway, the leave in conditioner is in my hair. My hair is separated. I'm going to start in the front. And I'm going to do the back of my hair off camera. These are going to be small to medium twists. You've seen me twist before. These are going to be put up as a protective style, not as a twist out. So I'm going to start first with the buttercream. And then I'm going to apply the gel. And I'm going to seal in everything with the Blue Magic. Okay? I'm going to do one of them just to show you my steps because I still have to re-detangle detangle my hair, re-detangle because I did it, but it's been a minute. I didn't do it when I separated my hair. Okay. So the white stuff that you see is the leave-in. Now, let me tell you about the product. It's very moisturizing. It has a very decent smell to it. The shampoo lathers up very great and leaves your hair feeling clean, not stripped, but you know it's clean, okay? The conditioner just adds more moisture 
to your hair. It just adds more moisture. And you let that, I let that stay on until I complete my shower and rinse it out. And it just feels, your hair just feels moisturized. It feels moisturized. So with the leave-in on here and my hair feels great. It feels great. I don't have nothing bad to say about the shampoo, conditioner, or the leave-in. Now we're going to go in with the buttercream. I'm not going to take much because as you can see, I have, I put a lot of leave-in in because I know my hair needed it. My hair needed it. I did not, did, I didn't show you guys my hair because I didn't want to disrespect her. And when I say her, her, she deserves more respect than that. So. I didn't want to disrespect her showing y'all how I had her looking instead of taking care of her like I supposed to have been doing. But like I said, I've been under the weather. I've burned myself using a heating pad. Because I know y'all wondering, what is she under the weather? Well, how long is she going to be under the weather? I have burned myself third degree burn using a heating pad. I just added the gel, I'm sorry. I just added the gel. Now I'm gonna add a little bit of Blue Magic. Yes, I had a tummy ache and I used a heating pad and I turned it off once, turned it back on and I had two C-sections. So it was partially numb at the bottom of my stomach. So I really couldn't, you know, feel it burning. And next thing you know, next morning I wake up, it was off, but I went there to take a shower and there goes some of my skin coming off. Yeah, very graphic. And I'm seeing a doctor and everything to get better. So here's my twist. This is probably going to be the size of the twist that I'm going to put in. They're not many twists. And, and some of them are probably going to be bigger than that. But I'm going to stick with that size. Try to stick with that size. And that really just depends on how you part your hair. You part your hair small, you end up working with smaller parts, smaller sections. So I'm gonna go in buttercream to this section, work it in. And I, so with me dealing with the burn, I haven't, I mean, I have been in so much pain, guys. So much pain. I just haven't been doing anything. Like right now, I'm getting ready to go back to another doctor's appointment. But I had to get up early. I was like, I got to get up and do something to my hair. And in a little gel. I got to get up and do something to my hair. And I was like, but I'm not going to disrespect my hair and put her on here looking crazy because she don't deserve that. And this is a um, castor oil blue magic. I don't know if I told you guys that or not. It's castor oil blue magic. It's my sealant. It is my sealant. And I'm going to split this one in two. Make sure it's detangled. And then after I do this one, I'm going to speed up the video and do the back off camera and come back and show you guys my twist. And I'm just twisting. Nothing special. No um, and coiling at the ends. 
no rope twist, no nothing, nothing special, guys. Just twisting, just twisting my hair. And y'all, my husband has been the best nurse you could ever ask for. My husband has taken care of my wound, has made sure my, he, he does my gauze, my creams, he does everything for me. My husband is, oh my God, God sent. I'm not saying that I have the best husband in the world, but I have the best husband in the world to me. To me, I have the best husband in the world. And I know it's other husbands out there that are just as good, but I can say that I got one of them. I got one of them. And it is amazing. Because I know a lot of females that got a husband, but they can't say that they got one of the best husbands in the world. I can say I got one of the best husbands in the world, and I thank God for that. I thank God for that. He's been there with me through my cancer. He's been there with me through my gastric bypass. He's been there with me through my total hysterectomy when my cysts burst and uh, yeah, I've had multiple surgeries and in the jail. He has been there and he has taken care of me all the way. And he is my best friend in the whole wide world. And I will be lost without him. Completely lost without him. God did me a solid. He did me a solid when he sent me Robert. When he gave me my husband, he did me, I couldn't ask for anything better. He gave me my husband, my husband and my two kids. I couldn't ask for anything better. That's it. I wouldn't have to ask for anything else. That's it. But let's go ahead. Let's speed up this video. I've given my testimony for the day. Drop your testimony down in the comment section. Let me know what God has done for you that only God could have done. Nobody else could have did it. Only God, and you know it, without a shadow of a doubt, that if it wasn't for God, this or that wouldn't be happening right now. Leave your comments down in the comment section, and I'm going to go ahead and speed up this video. Let's get it. She looks good and she feels good and she is moisturized. Mm. She is juicy. She loves me. She loves me. She appreciates me. Whoa. 
talking about this is how you take care of her this is this is this is how you take care of her and this is what she used to now see I can wear these for seven days and then when I take them down the next product I'll be using will have a deep conditioner in it because I skipped that step which I'm not used to I, I use a deep deep condition so I'm gonna have to go in with my hair mayonnaise I'm going to have to go in with my hair mayonnaise, my ORS, and deep condition my hair. The next time I do my hair, you guys will know because I'll be doing it with you guys. With you all, yes, I will. I sure will. I sure will. So, once again, we use Cara Care Buttercream. We use Cara Care Oh, protein, I can't even pick it up. Clear protein styling gel. I'm trying to get the lid back on it. Don't want to waste that. I think I paid a good little penny for that. And we went in with the leave-in, the shampoo, the conditioner. And we sealed it all in with the Blue Magic Castor Oil hair sealant uh-huh uh-huh uh -huh. see because that's a sealant blue magic is a sealant it, it's a it's not just a moisturizer it seals in your moisture know that know that that's a little point that's a free one that's free you can't get that for free so i have up my protective style for the week I'm about to go to the doctor, continue to take care and nurse my body, and now I don't have to worry about my hair because it's up in a protective style. So if you're new here, go ahead and subscribe. Click on the notification bell. Also, make sure you leave your testimony down in the comments down below. Leave your testimony. It don't have to be about a husband. Leave, leave, leave something down below about what God has done for you. What has God done for you that only God can do? Think about it. Marinate. Let it marinate. Only God could have done it. And I will see you guys in the next video. So keep God first in everything you do. And I do mean everything. And I'll see y'all later. Bye.